at the grocery store or the gas station. And for some of you, even at work, there are people everywhere that refuse to use a mask in public places despite health risk. And here to discuss the liability and legality of mask wearing amid the coronavirus pandemic is our chief legal correspondent, Laura McNeil. Dr. Laura McNeil, hello. Hi. Glad to see you again. So I know you're a big fan of masks. <laughs> of the masks and I am not so much so I'm a rule breaker. Uh, so what determines whether someone could be fined or jailed simply for not wearing their mask in public? Um, definitely it depends on where you live. Luckily for you, CE, where you live, there's no penalties attached with not wearing a mask in public. However, if you live in, for instance, Miami-Dade County, you will be fined excuse me, there's a mandatory requirement for you to wear a mask. And so what's interesting though is you could be in Miami and not wear a mask and there's not a penalty, but if you're in Laredo, Texas, and I do love te Texas, the state of Texas, because I'm big on brisket, but if you're in Texas and you are caught not wearing a mask in public, you will be fined up to $1,000 and a possible felony uh, misdemeanor, excuse me, filed against you as well. So where you live really, really matters. So you want to make sure that you're aware of what the rules are in your particular city, county, and state. And where should folks look for those rules? Well, you're going to want to look at the website. So you want to look at, for instance, again, if you live in Miami, your local uh, city's website, you also want to look at the county's website that you live in. So Miami-Dade County and then the state of Florida. And that's a great example. For instance, in the state of Illinois, there is a statewide mandate requiring you to wear a mask, whereas it, there is not a state mandate in Florida. So although you might live in Sarasota and not have to wear a mask, if you're in Miami-Dade County, you do. So it's very important that you check all three levels of government's website again your city government website the county and then the state but what if i cannot get my hands on one i don't want to pay for one or i can't afford it how can you know they force me to use a mask Oh, I love that. Nice try. You're going to have to wear some type of face covering CE. So yes, even though you cannot find a mask, the, the mandates require some type of face covering. It doesn't have to be a medical grade mask or even a fancy mask. You can simply take a handkerchief, wrap it around your, your mouth, and as long as your nose is covered, you are in compliance with those mandates. And we're talking about children as well? Yes, and that depends, again, the age is dependent upon, again, those specific laws within your state, city, or county. So, for instance, um, if you live in the state of Illinois, children two and older must wear a mask, but in Maryland, only children over the age of nine. So, again, it's really important that you check with your local areas, county, and state to see what the specific guidelines are. Chief Legal Analyst, Dr. Laura McNeil, thank you so much for joining us tonight. Thank you.